Hey guys, bringing you another video of Tackle. So, I updated my Tackle box, obviously. I went from these three boxes right here. Sorry about this, this is in my storage room. I got a lot of stuff in here. Um, I went from these three boxes to this big box. And I just wanted to show you everything. I don't really want to pop that out right now. But it's got drawers. Which I haven't got enough tackle to fill them all, but I've come pretty close to filling this one. I got a few rebel lures, a couple headings, um, some cheap gummy things, you know, a bunch of minnows. Got all my these are freshwater bass hooks, more freshwater hooks, but for a different species. And trout hooks. Then I got a big old weedless spoon, um, a super duper lure called super dupers. Um, I got a smaller spoon. I got a mouse in here. I got a rooster tail. I got a rooster tail. I got, um, I think that one's a fish head. Yeah, I got a rooster tail, a fish head. There's a fish head right there. I got another miscellaneous spinner. Right there. Um, I'm not quite sure what this little guy is, but I thought he was cool. I got another miscellaneous. And I got another rooster tail. It's a rooster tail. And I got a miscellaneous right there. I got bunch of those crappy gummy worms some of these little things I think they're supposed to be little frogs uh, I got these for free from a sample um, I got these little gummies I got more of those annoying uh, frog things uh, you see I got those worm things right here that don't really do much and then I got these frog things I got more of the worm things, some uh, some minnows. I found this one on shore. I got some more of these little things. All right, so let's pack this up. Put back. Um, the other side over here. This is my gummy lure box all my gummy lures in. See, I got a, see in here, I got a tube, and I got this guy, this guy I found. I got some of these uh, four inch worms. Um, I forgot what they're called. I found this one on shore. I use it for wacky rigging. If you don't know what wacky ring it is, it's when you put a hook in the middle of the worm, straight through, and then it goes like this in the water. And I guess it attracts larger bass. Um, and I got all these gummy lures. These are all tubes that have, um, uh, what are they called? I don't know, but these little jig heads. Yeah, there you go. I have jig heads uh, that go through tubes. I got them through the frog things. I got them through these worm things. I got some I got this weedless hook in there that I found. A few gummies. I got a I caught a big old pickerel on this. Um caught a two foot long pickerel on this. It hit the water and the pickerel went straight for it. It went quick. And I got those white worms. Um and then I got much more impressive stuff in the other side. Just put that out. Close the other side. Alright, so this is a Clacken Minnow. Rapala Clacken Minnow 08. It won't focus. I don't know what it is, but videos don't focus. I got a hidden torpedo. Hidden Magnum Torpedo. Um, I got a Rapala two-piece. 
I'm not 100% sure what it's called, but it's a two-piece. Um, what is this? Jitterbugs. I got jitterbugs. I got two of them. Um, not quite sure what this is. I found it. I'm not 100% sure what it is, but, um, your hook goes there, and then it opens up to reveal a hook. And this line, when you pull the line, it opens. I don't know if you can see this, but, see? And then, I got this. This is a Rapala. I'll show you the box later. Um, these are Rebel. This is a, a Crayfish. This, I believe, is supposed to be a perch. I don't know. I'm not 100% sure. Don't judge me. <laughs> uh, this is a cricket. Thought I used the crickets. They're good on sunnies. This is a little perch. This is, this wasn't from Rebel, I don't think. By the way, it makes noise. Um, I got a plug. This one I found got another plug. This one's a different kind of plug. And then I got... These are both from Rebel. They're both Rebel plugs. Um, and then I got, I got the clear version, and I got the colored version. Um, I have two of these because one I pulled out of a tree. It was snagged. And these are called Super Sport. Super Sport. At least that's what these are called. Let's put them both back in there. And then I got this little crappy that came in a three pack, but my dad has one of them and I lost the other one. Call it um, Pickerel on these. They really like these. Alright, and. Uh, Let's put this back. Let's see my monstrosity of a box. Um, and here I got a couple spinners. This is a spoon spinner. This is another spoon spinner. I had a third one, but it got uh, broken, so I just gave it away. And then this is a uh, jig head spinner. Uh, the jig head is on it right now. Um, got the uh, the spins to let me get weights. I got this little weight box. I got some heavy. Um, I think those are quarter ounce. Put that in there. I got all my bobbers. I don't really like bobbers. And then let's open the top. And this is where things get a little interesting. Where I keep all my doobies. All right, so I got some uh, some weights, some tie-on weights. I got the quarter ounce weights. I got two stringers. I got a catfish rig. I think there's a, a panfish rig under it. No, I don't know what happened to the panfish rig. I think I got it lost. Um, I got some of the fast octopus, and then I got some of these other hooks that were given to me. What are these? These are. Renegade Bronze Aberdeen Hooks. Aberdeen Hooks. Um, then I got the spin thing that allows me to get hooks out of it. I got Eagle Eye Hooks under it. And I string my own hooks sometimes just to save some money because I have a lot of hooks. And I always use the Quick Connect. I got spacers that I'm not using right now. Pliers, pliers, a uh, knife, uh, and more needle nose pliers. I got this uh, hook remover. I got pre strung gummies in there. And down there, that's a penny lure. I'll show you how to make that if you guys would like. Um, this was this was the two piece box. It's called. I don't even know what it's called. Countdown, possibly. 
and this was the smaller two piece and it's um a jointed shrap shrad shr I'm so horrible at reading through my iPad screen. It's a uh, jointed shad wrap. Then I got some eight pound string here just in case if I need it. I've got some power bait, these are grape worms. And then I got slurpy salamanders. Slurpees. Um uh, I forgot what these are called. But they're they're like salamanders. I go in here, I got an assortment of things. I got hookless spinners that are used to replace, I think. I'm not 100% sure how those work. Um, I got some, uh, some quick connects, weights, some uh, jig heads with uh, feathers, some feather jig heads. Um, and I got some larger hooks, some regular jig heads, smaller hooks, even smaller hooks, medium hooks, and yeah, that's about it. Alright guys, thanks for watching the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Alright, if you would like any reviews on individual lures and how they work and how good they work, um, yeah, comment. Thanks.